My name is Ibrahim Kamara. I'm a psychology major and I play on the Georgetown football team. So I was born in Sierra Leone. When I was born, my mom and dad didn't have like enough money to pay for me. So they left me at the hospital and they had to go get like their paycheck and came back. So my dad went and got his paycheck and they came back and that's when like, like they got me and they took me home and everything. Coming home from the hospital was the first of many obstacles Ibrahim Kamara would have to face. At the time he was born, Sierra Leone was in the midst of a civil war. His father left for the United States so that he could eventually bring his wife and children to safety. But in the interim, Ibrahim, his siblings, and his mother struggled in their home country. But just finding food really wasn't like easy really. It was a time where we used to just go home and just eat like bread and sugar water and go to sleep. We used to just go from houses to houses, from living with my grandma to my aunt to like a friend of hers really until like we got like a house. As a kid that's only like five or six years old, I feel like my mind was so evolved at the time. Like I just, I saw a lot of like traumatic things at a young age. So it made my mind grow up so faster than it was. And I feel like that's why I'm still so childish today and everything. I'm a, I'm a big kid, I always say that. My mind had to grow up so fast that my, I never got to be a kid sometimes, you know? He'll make you laugh every day when you get a chance to talk to him. He's an extremely fun personality to be around. He doesn't stay down often. I think he has a, uh, he's got that ability to rebound from some setbacks and make him setups for himself. You know, from his family story to some of the things he's had to deal with here at Georgetown and some of the things he's done to really support his family back home in New Jersey. He really comes back from some of the adversity and I think it makes him stronger overall. Kamara's strength was not built by accident. He learned it from his mother. In 2005, she was able to get herself and her children out of Sierra Leone and to Banjul, Gambia. My mom got like a job and she got us our own house and everything. And that was like a, like a whole new experience and everything, like a whole new like country, like a whole new city. It was tough, but like my mom, like she found like a way to make it happy, you know? Like she had jobs and like she really worked extra to have us like eat and everything. Finally in 2006, the family was able to reunite with their father in the United States. Kamara started playing football and became a highly sought after recruit. Yet one thing remained the same, his mother's strength and sacrifices for her children. I went to a private school my senior year and I didn't have money to pay for the school. My mom, like she was working overtime, just struggling to make ends meet for, for me. I'm trying so hard one day so I can repay her, like repay her for that. I'm the first one in my family to, come to, to go to college. She was very happy about that and she's very proud. Like she always says, God sent me in her life to help her. To how his mom has supported this family to now how IB has turned into the supporter for his family and the younger guys on our team. You know, just to see it come full circle. Very proud of him uh, within his fifth year here for what he's doing, not just on the field, but off the field as well.